The current budget, uh, if I remember looking at it, um, that was being proposed through the Warren article, um, if I looked at it correctly, I saw about a $200,000 increase, I believe is what it was. Um, when you look at a budget, folks, there are two parts. You have the mandatory part and the discretionary part. If you look at the discretionary part of this year budget and compare it to last, it's $100,000 less. But the mandatory items that we had no control over takes care of all of the increases in your budget this year. When you look at the increases that occurred in our budget this year, which was the health insurance increase, the uh, High school education costs, which are mandated, we have to pay for these kids to go to high school and transportate. You look at those items alone, folks, you will see that all of the dollars in those is the increase in your budget this year. But these things, as our school gets older, these things are going to happen, folks. And when and it's not in the budget, we don't have an opportunity to have that kind of a fund. And I look at that fund as a major, uh, major fund for, for major expenses that are totally unexpected. We should have to ask the, the taxpayers to use it when the time comes. But if the money's available, I think we should be able to use it for that. And only that. For an article. Nine go, does pass. I could not see a reason to be using that money either. I think um, best would be to put, you know, get it back. And um, the only time, assuming that this doesn't go through, would be for a major catastrophe to happen at one of the schools that we needed it. And again, then it would be decided upon by the town. Thank you. Um, the other thing would be to evolve and keep working with the STEM program. Now, I'm not sure exactly how the letters fit in, but now they're adding art. Um, so to make sure that we're incorporating the science, technology, is it engineering, math, and art. And um, we're We need to be sure that before they leave our school, they are comfortable with their Chromebooks, they know how to do the resources, and get information that they need to be successful. Right now, we're not doing that. Whereas the superintendent is working for the town, he is the liaison between, was it the four different towns? Kids, our numbers are increasing. We're not getting any smaller, so we're going Um, my understanding is that we are far exceeding the numbers for Pinkerton at this point, uh, so I agree that I don't think it's going to be an issue in the near future. We'll understand that the minimums are determined based upon a three-year average. And there is a clause in the contract uh, that should that change drastically, for some reason we have the option to uh, go into that contract and make some changes.